Some of the decisions, I mean, in all the games, are great, but Mass Effect 1's decisions with what to do with Arachni, what to do on Vermeer, they're so memorable. We need to go to Eternity, don't we? Do you have anything flashier? I want something that says... A Batarian training group has announced plans to sue the Citadel Council. The Batarians claim that slavery is an... I like a Volus as a crew member as well. That would be quite amusing. I'm gonna have that asshole arrested. Uh, who? Watch yourself if you go in there. Some human is causing trouble. He's demanding that I sign the place over to him. Is there anything I can do? Oh no, that crap might fly on Omega, but this is Ilium. I'm hooking up security cams now. If he or anybody else causes trouble, I'll have their asses arrested. Oh, or I could just punch him. I had about a Krogan last time. Oh, you know what this means. See why we're here. Salarians do not get married. My family simply negotiated a reproduction contract. Whatever. It's the closest you guys get to a wedding, and that means you get a bachelor party. End of story. All right, where is he? You're really holding out on me? I'm a man on the edge. I got nothing to lose. Uh huh. I'll do anything to get the job done. I'll go all the way without a second thought. Uh-huh. <laughs> I can't ride. how far I'll go. I learned how to shove a gun in people's faces from Commander Shepard. Hey, if you know this idiot, can you rein him in before I slap his ass with a singularity? Shepard? Is it really you? It's me, Conrad Werner. We met on the Citadel? I wanted to become a Spectre? Oh, uh, and then you shoved a gun in my face? You I don't think I did. Extreme. I learned that lesson well. So you're alive, Did I? Huh? I hear it goes like that in the biz. Why don't you sit back and watch how it's done? I got some asses to kick. Oh, I don't want to shoot his foot. I kind of want to shoot his foot. I'm gonna hit him. Conrad. That wasn't a hit, really. Ha! Kick him in the quad. Sorry, my father was a Krogan. Man, I should have gotten better armor. That really hurts. Anyway, <laughs> get angry if you want, but somebody had to do something. You were dead. I stepped up. How did you get that armor? Oh, they make some pretty convincing replicas these days, if you're willing to pay. <laughs> Getting the whole getup was pretty expensive, but my wife was really supportive. She even paid for my shuttle fare off-world. I'm not surprised. So, you just wander the galaxy, righting wrongs? Hey, don't say it like that. I talk to people, you know? Ask them if they have... As I always say the gun thing. I can solve. You'd be surprised yeah, how many figures. people are just waiting for someone to talk to them. Sometimes I poke through crates too, you know, for extra credits. Training is a cop. Do you have any actual combat training? I'm saving the galaxy, Shepard. I don't have time for training. Don't you get it? You were a big oh, jerk. Oh, Conrad. But you saved the galaxy and showed other races that humans mattered. I wasn't a jerk, Conrad. You died. The galaxy and I did die, that's true. Shepherd. We all did. I had to do something. <sighs> Any decent security system will detect that you aren't in the military, much less part of my squad. I just say that I'm deep cover and don't appear on systems. I'm doing the best I can, okay? You were a hero. You saved the galaxy and showed everyone what humanity could do. And then you died. The galaxy needed someone like you, Shepard. We all did. I had to do something. 
Why were you trying to get the deed to this place? This place is actually a front for a red sand dealer. I need to take it over to crack the ring. What? Who the hell told you that? Do you order that <laughs> weapon store near the carport? She's an undercover cop. She told me about oh, it when I introduced myself. Listen, crap for brains. First, we don't sell red sand. Second, red sand is legal on Ilium. You just need a license. I'll talk to this undercover cop and figure out what's going on. Thank you. If I kill annoying customers, it usually causes property damage. That comes out of my pay. Just let me know if you need any help, <laughs> Shepard. Uh, Conrad, I think we're good. You know what would have been really cool? If Conrad joins the team in three. Thanks for taking care of that crazy guy. Saves me having to beat him to death with his own spine. <laughs> that makes the other customers nervous. Anyway, this is Eternity, and I'm Athena, a sorry matriarch and bartender. Get you anything? You're an Asari matriarch? I thought matriarchs serve as honored advisors. Right. Which I do here at this bar. I know. Not what you'd expect. But nobody on Thessia wanted to listen to my wise counsel, so here I am. Dad was a Krogan who... I see, yeah, that's the wars. home world, isn't it? My mother fought in the Krogan rebellions. I've pretty much seen it all. What's it like, living for nearly a thousand years? Violent. Wars break out. Colonies get destroyed. Sometimes you hear good news, like that colony on Pharaoh surviving. That's the exception, though. You find peace in whatever arms will hold you. Turian, Elcor, Hanar. Even had a pure-blood daughter. I was the father. It didn't work out. And one day you wake up, your figure's gotten matriarchal, and everyone else is too young to remember how the Quarians looked inside those suits. I mean, there's so much going on in this one conversation with this one NPC who has nothing to do with anything, really. The attention to detail in this game is so good. Your mother fought in the Krogan rebellions? I don't know whether she fought. She scouted, sniped a few people, and blew up a couple of space stations. You know, commando stuff. She put the old commando leathers on for special nights with Dad. Goddess, that was embarrassing. You said your father fought in the Rachni Wars. Yeah, when he was young. Loved showing off his war scars. Krogan think they're sexy. Me, I go for asses. When I was a girl, he'd tell me about landing on this poison-filled world and stomping a Rachni queen in the muck. Scientists say all that stuff about us getting genetic material from the father is crap. Seems like I got a bit of his mouth, though. I don't know for sure, but I've got a pretty good idea judging by the, the shape of the face. What's it like, living for nearly a thousand years? Violent. Wars break out. Colonies get destroyed. Sometimes you hear good news, like that colony on Pharaoh surviving. That's the exception, though. You find peace in whatever arms will hold you. Well, we've already done that, then. And one day you wake up, your figure's gotten matriarchal, and everyone else is too young to remember how the Quarians looked inside those suits. Thanks for telling me about that. That's what I'm here for, babe. Get you anything else? Yeah, give us a drink. Like a drink. Sure. I'll set up a tab at the drink kiosk. Knock yourself out. Literally, if you want. Just don't drink anything for Turians or Quarians. Does nasty things to your insides. Once saw Krogan drink a liquefied Turian on a dare six or seven centuries back. Nobody came out of that one looking pretty. What's it like being an Asari Matriarch? Pretty much like being anything else. My parents had it more interesting than I did. Thanks for telling me about that. Right. Don't eat the nuts in the Red Bulls. They're for Turians and Quarians. You'll get cramps. Drink. No, the one that she poured me. Oh, they were. Mystery drink. It was revealed in Mass Effect 3, so it's not who I think it is then. Let's just do a shot liquor. Is she Liara's father then, from what you've said? Why do I get Paragon points for buying a drink? 
Right, so anyway, now we need to go and... Oh, it's okay. Our amino acids are all different. So it's not like we can get diseases or anything if we go natural. I'm telling you, this is why you shouldn't date humans. So that's how to explain about species fluid contact. Completely killed the mood. I bet it would. How could he be so insensitive? Do you think this, this Turian's into her? You deserve somebody who respects you. Yeah, he is. Somebody who's going to treat you right. Oh, I think I'm just going to stop dating for a while. No, don't do that. Don't let some humans <laughs> It's always the same thing. Ooh, she could get sick. She's vulnerable. I wonder what she looks like under the helmet. You'll find someone out there who cares about you for who you are. Someone whose food you can eat, even. Are you hinting at you, Mr. Turian? Um, yeah, now you've said that, that vaguely sounds rem like I've. I remember something about Liara's father, but I didn't. I'd either put the two and two together and just not remembered, or never it. put it together Bad fully. Education. What happened? Is Ariana alright? She's fine, but you listed a man named Niket as your trusted source? He contacted me, warning that your father has sent Eclipse mercenaries to make a sweep. He suggested that the mercs might be watching for you personally. He's offered to escort Oriana's family to the terminal instead. Don't trust didn't him. didn't mention anything about the cat. He's a friend. He and I go back a, a long way. Do you want to bring in any of your other Ilium contacts, Ms. Lawson? No. You and the cat are the only two I trust on this. What well, information okay. do you have about the mercenaries? Let's shoot some mercs. I wasn't going to do this mission, actually. They're working for an organization Ms. Lawson warned us about. I could try to alert the authorities, but so far they've done nothing illegal. You made the right decision. We'll handle this ourselves. Making changes now could be dangerous. Are you sure you can trust Niket? Absolutely. He's one of my oldest friends. I trust him with Ariana. Lentea, we'll follow Niket's suggestion. Shepard and I will take the car and draw their attention. Have Niket escort the family to the shuttle. Give him full access to the family's itinerary, just to be safe. Understood, Ms. Lawson. So the plan is for us to get shot down by Eclipse while your sister gets to safety? Eclipse will be under orders to take my sister alive. They won't risk anything that could kill us. Alright, let's do it. Ready whenever you are, Miranda. Yeah. Thank you. Some games just appreciate this. the cast, the the voice it. acting, the script, everything is just perfect. And I think this is one of them. The entire like as a series, the first the trilogy, I guess. Never really fell in love with, with Andromeda. But as a game series, these are incredible. And I, getting back into two, I've really enjoyed playing it. Uh, I could take Jack, because she was with us, and that's the kind of rule I've been running. But Mercs and Garrus tend to go very well for me. I'll take Jack. Jack was with us, so... We haven't tried the art projector yet, so we'll stick with that. I haven't got anything good there. Yeah, that'll do. Damn it! Eclipse I'm torn with Andromeda. Be dropping troops in the cargo areas. Yeah, I don't. Think, I mean, Jack and Miranda don't get on, so I like having them together because they they do a bit of bickering. The gunships look so cool in this as well. I love the designs for just about everything in this universe. Put us down in that cover behind them. Let's hope they really do want to take us alive. Well, we'll just kill them anyway. Hold fire! I said hold fire, damn it! I got this. Since you're not firing yet, I trust you know who I am. Yeah, they said you'd be in the car. You're the bitch that kidnapped our boss's little girl. Kidnapped? This doesn't involve you. I suggest you take your men and go. Think you've got it all lined up, huh? Captain Inyala's already moving in on the kid. She knows about Niket. And Inyala. Be helping you. What do you mean, Niket won't be helping us? Nothing you need to worry about. Nobody's gonna get killed unless you do something stupid. 
You walk away now, the girl goes back to her father, and everybody's happy. Mm, don't like that outcome. Me. Should we be talking to Captain Inyala about this? You don't want to talk to the captain. She's not as polite as I am. She's the best commando I've ever seen. I've seen her tear people in half with her biotics. And she's getting paid a lot to stop you. She gets in my way, she'll never have a chance to spend it. You're not getting yeah. Miranda's sister. I'm happy you with that. push this, it'll go badly for you. Captain Inyala ordered us to give you one chance to walk away. This whole time we've been talking, my men have been lining up shots. You think that worries me? I say the word, we unleash hell on your squad. So I suggest you walk away nicely, unless you want the... <laughs> That's a bug I've not seen before. They've seen us. One of you has... We'll put that on first. Okay, you've got that. Oh no, why are you... You'd be better with that for the time being. On it. I really wish Sprint was on left stick. Mount that one. Yeah, that Solarian had a bit of a bit of a surprise moment there, didn't he? She. I don't know. Don't want to assume. Come on, we need to get to Okay, Shockwave is actually really good. But we need that, because this gun burns through ammo. What class? Uh, I made a bit of a mistake because I really like the Revenant. Well, it's the assault rifle, but it's, it's basically a machine gun, isn't it? It just shoots through bullets and enemies. Um, so I went Soldier. And I'm really regretting it now. I really hope that that's something they've changed for the Legendary Edition, that you can just equip any weapon, regardless of what Hang class on, you are. Don't think it'll be the case, but... Shepard, I think I owe you an explanation. Ariana is my twin, genetically. But my father grew her when I was a teenager. She was meant to replace me. I couldn't let my so father do what this. he did to me. So I rescued her. She's almost a woman now. Why didn't you tell me that we were saving a kid? She's not a child. She'll be 19 this year. But, well, it didn't seem relevant at the time, I suppose. There are people who'd use her against me. I'm very protective when it comes to Oriana. I'm sorry I didn't trust you sooner. You deserve well, to know. You can trust me now. If Eclipse knows where Oriana is, they'll be moving in on her soon. We need to hurry. Agreed. I'm a bit worried by what the Merc said. If they've got to Niket somehow, this is going to be harder than I'd planned. According to yeah, the specs I reviewed, Shepherd. we'll need to cut through the cargo processing yard to get to Oriana. There have been points in this where I have really not enjoyed playing. Like, it's the lack of useful biotics, I guess. Can you tell me anything about the cargo processing yard? The we'll biotic explosions, uh, did they come in in three? Finding targets won't be um, easy. They were great. Stay sharp. And these cargo transports carry hazardous materials. So watch what you shoot at. I hope your friend can be trusted. Absolutely. You can't. Niket is one of my oldest friends. I guess you could say he was my only real friend. He's the only person I didn't cut ties with when I left my father. Is there a chance your father could be using Niket to get to you? I'm sure he's tried, but Niket's one of the few people who understands what my father is really like. I trusted him with my life when I ran from my father, Shepard. He won't betray me now. Let's go find Niket and Orion. Right. And let Jack blow some stuff up. Yeah, I think for three, I'll be changing to 
whatever the class is that lets you use tech and biotics so you can prime and detonate because it's so much fun they're on the far side of the conveyor line time your shots uh, I would but I've just started timing this so how about you guys shoot and I'll um I'll hack terminals I've not noticed any um any detonations while playing too, so now hit with everything. Oh yeah, we can't do that. I also like that three they um get rid of that. They did the weight mechanic thing so that you could have your powers charged really quick. Have I not got any? Oh no, I haven't. Is there one still there? No. Oh, Pamo was good. Um, I'll go disruptor for this though. Let's just get rid of that. There's elements of Andromeda that I really like, like how it plays. The story was wasn't great. The um the characters were just kind of boring. But the dodge and the jump thing felt really good and the I don't know, for a Mass Effect light game, it works well. So I'd have loved them to have taken 1, 2 and 3 and tweaked the system to be a little bit more modern friendly. So machine gun. This is valuable. Yoink. There's something to hack though, right? No. And they brought mercs. Not mercs, mechs. <laughs> no shield! Okay, they can take care of them. I guess. Yeah, I agree, and I think that's Bioware's problem now. They're great with ideas, but they just struggle to execute them these days. Isn't there somebody still? I think I've locked myself in a bad spot. This might be useful. Probably will. Where are these other ones coming from? Or is that it? I guess we'll hack this then. No. Oh. Balls. That'll do. What do you? What are your thoughts on? Uh, on what? Well, I'm calling it Mass Effect Five, but Mass Effect Four. Pytrex, what do you think? Oh wow, that was... Ow. No, that's not allowed. That fired two rockets at me. Well, 
Wait, what? Authorized for lethal force. Yeah, lost shield. Unit member offline. I'll kill you all. Yeah, go on, Jack. You get him out. Yeah, whatever the next Mass Effect game is going to be. I do quite like those screams. Pop up. Go on, show me that head. We should maybe do that. I can take um, I don't know what happened then, the but I feel like that rocket should have hit me. Sweep and clear. I think we're looking at three, four years away, probably, because there's been some big shakeups at BioWare recently. I think you're right. It's bringing all the games together. Uh, I don't think that they know quite how to do... Well, they're clearly never going to do an Andromeda sequel because it... They just didn't handle it well when it failed. But I think... I don't know. If, if they can tie it all together and then keep the focus on everything properly, then great. But I'm slightly worried because they're building it up like it's the original crew from the first game. Or we'll, we see the silhouettes of certain people and obviously Liara, who we know lives for, you know, centuries. So it depends what direction they want to go and how they want to play it. But we'll see. It could, I mean, it could be very interesting. But they could also fumble the ball and it's terrible. So I'm, while I'm interested in what they do and I'm excited in what they're going to do, uh, I want to see how they handle Legendary Edition first. Because if they really fumble that, they have no chance. I 